Two wide bodies built for the middle ground, Airbus's A33900neo and Boeing's 767-400ER, one modernised for efficiency, the other proven by decades, but their engines couldn't be more different. The A33900neo runs on Rolls-Royce Trent 7000 engines derived from the 787's Trent 1000. Each produces up to 72,800 pounds of thrust with a bypass ratio of 10 to 1. That means more air moved around the core, higher efficiency and lower noise. The 767-400ER, by contrast, uses older generation turbofans, either the GECF 680C2 or Pratt and Whitney PW4062. They max out at 63,500 pounds of thrust, with a bypass ratio closer to 5 to 1. Smaller fans, less efficient, but simpler and easier to maintain. Airbus designed the A330neo to chase long-haul fuel efficiency and emissions targets with modern high-bypass technology. Boeing 767 stuck with lighter structures and simpler engines, making it a favourite for freighters and operators looking for reliability over bleeding-edge performance. On paper, the Airbus wins in thrust, bypass ratio and fuel burn. But the Boeing counters with lower weight, proven systems and a platform that still earns money hauling freight worldwide. Two designs, decades apart, still fighting for relevance. So which matters more, Airbus's modern thrust and efficiency or Boeing's lighter frame and workhorse reliability? The mid-weight wide-body debate is yours.